We are Pipeline Design and Engineering and today we're going to talk a little bit about ball plungers or sometimes called spring plungers. This is a ball plunger. Uh, the, the body of the ball plunger comes in different styles. This one is threaded. Sometimes it's just a straight body that can be press fit into a drilled hole. This one is designed to be screwed into a threaded hole. Sometimes they have a little flange around the top. This one does not. But what they all have in common is a ball at the tip that is spring-loaded. You can see that I can push that ball down and it pops right back up. Spring plungers are used for a variety of different applications, um, but we're going to take a look at one right here. So this part incorporates a, split, a spring plunger. You can't see it in the part. Uh, it's actually pressed fit into this block here, and it's underneath this, uh, this white plastic tab there. And how it works is, let's see, you can see right there that, that metal part, that is the top of the spring plunger. It's kind of hard to see the actual head. Let's see if we can... Now you can kind of see it in there. But a spring plunger is in there and you see that the, the, the steel part, the steel disc above the spring plunger has a V-groove in it. And that V-groove engages with the spring plunger, or the ball and the spring plunger, to, uh, to hold it in place. And uh, what happens is you end up getting this really nice tactile feel when you rotate this part. You can see there's another V-groove. If I can get the focus right. There, another V-groove and that, uh, that steel part I'll rotate it around. So there's, there's the other one that we were using initially. So this is one great use for a spring plunger. It gives you this really wonderful tactile feel when you're moving your part. And by the way, this particular part is rotating, but uh, you could very easily do the same thing with uh, a part that moves linearly, that is straight. This one just happens to be, to be designed to rotate. So anyway, that is one uh, practical application of how to use a spring plunger. If you've found this content helpful, consider enrolling in our signature program at MyPipelineAcademy.com. Whether you're an individual interested in beginning a new career as a mechanical designer or a company interested in training your new engineering hires, our signature program helps students develop the practical skills they need to be productive mechanical design engineers. Seating is limited. We hope to see you there soon.